What's up? This your boy PK. I'm live. I mean, I guess y'all heard me on my Man G Gov page. And what I want to talk about tonight is the state of the game. The state of the game right now is we have a lot of people in the game, man, that really don't appreciate this shit. That really on some fuckery shit. They really don't respect game. So what they're doing, man, is they're taking their itty bitty pieces, their little bitty, itty bitty ass game, and they're trying to make it look like it's some real big game. But those of us who are masters of the game, who really play this shit, we know what's really going on. See, these niggas are haters, and what they want to do is they want to bring this shit down. Man, it's a shame, man, when you have a man that don't have nothing to do but post lies all day, every day. I want all my real niggas to know, everybody that fuck with me, I no longer fuck with folks alert. Don't go to that site. Don't have nothing to do with it. Don't even go there and comment. If you fuck with me, don't fuck with him because that shit is suspect over there for real. I know y'all say, well, Ken, you fuck with the nigga. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck you talk about, Ken? Why you fuck with the nigga, Ken? Yeah, I fuck with the nigga because I had to fuck with the nigga. I'm going to tell you why I fuck with the nigga. I fuck with the nigga because he was disrespecting all of my friends. And the only way that I could stop this dude was to get up under him, get cool with him, and get him to take his site down. So I'm the reason why the site was tucking down from the beginning. I'm the reason why you didn't hear from Kiko for three years. Because I had to get it at nigga head and I had to explain to him that this shit you doing, my nigga, is some straight sucker shit. This man, you know, he go and he put people's information. You know, whether somebody is doing something illegal. Well, I mean, why would you, as a street person, why would you want to put people's information on the internet? You see what I'm saying? Why would you want to call somebody this or that and you know that you can have this person murdered? or killed, or robbed, or what have you. What type of heart do you have? Do you have any more fiber inside your body? You see what I'm saying? I mean, even if I did hate somebody, I wouldn't put it on the internet. I would catch them slipping, and I would handle my business. You see understand what I'm saying? But, you know, for people that you don't know, and this is the problem with the brother Kiko, he puts stuff up on people that he don't even know. He don't have no beef with them or nothing, all to make a couple views to get a couple of dollars pennies man i had google ads kiko that shit don't pay no money man that shit don't pay no money man you see this shit man this 30 bands right here my dude you see what i'm saying this this peanuts man niggas spin this shit man in uh, uh, past time but you want to make this shit you know a situation man where you hate the game now you going and pimps up holes down you know what i'm saying I me mean, i already said the pimps up holes down with some bullshit you know what I'm saying? I mean, and that white dude that you had on there, Kiko, that motherfucker don't know shit, man. Because if you look at the beginning of Pimps Up, Holes Down, the, the motherfucking uh, director, Brent Owens, said that I had to come up with some real money in order to pay these pimps. Because real pimps got to get paid. That motherfucker put some money up. You understand what I'm saying? He put some money up and he paid everybody. You see what I'm saying? No, I mean, it's a few people that didn't get paid. So all that's bullshit, man. You know what I'm saying? All I'm telling you, my dude, is, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you're not being smooth. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to give you some game. I was trying to give you some finesse. I was trying to make you smooth. Because you don't you, you don't go around, my dude, picking on people that ain't done nothing to you. That don't make no sense. And, you know, people on the Internet, they like to hear that. They like to hear you roast somebody. They like to hear you call people snitches. They like to see you put people paperwork up. They like to see you see people that get busted and so on and so forth. Man, listen, man, that ain't going to get you no money, partner. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, all the talent that you got, all the knowledge that I know that I listened to you over the years express, the best you can do is to become a professional hater, my dude, to hate on people. To record people conversation and then when you don't like them you put the recording up you don't even know how you look man i've never told you this man but really don't nobody like you do nobody like you everybody that i talk to they say that you're the police everybody call you the police and i be say man the man ain't no police because if he was the police he would have been arrested me you know what i'm saying i ain't never seen a man with no badge 
But I said one thing I do know, and I stopped him from doing it. I said he do do a lot of dry snitches. You don't post nobody hotel rooms up. You don't post nobody back page up. You don't post nobody hoe up. You don't do that shit, man. That's the, this is the state of the game right now. This is the type of people that we got call themselves players and hoes and pimps. You know, people that I've been addicted for no reason, man. Hey, man, back in the day, man, everybody got along. Everybody respected each other. Everybody loved each other. That's the way the game got to get back to. You know what I'm saying? We can't be sitting around here, man, hating on somebody because, you know what I'm saying, they caught a case or hating on somebody because, you know, they might have, you know, ran their mouth or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's not my business. Hey, look here, man, if you get caught up and, you know what I'm saying, you go and you talk to the authorities, that's your business. You see what I'm saying? That ain't got nothing to do with me. That ain't got nothing to do with me. You know what I'm saying? I don't care who, man, and all the niggas I know in the streets, man, all these motherfucking drug dealers and these hustlers, all these motherfuckers done told something. You understand what I'm saying? Hey, man, this shit ain't, I mean, you know, this, this is just what niggas do right now. But you understand me? It ain't my job to put it on the internet. You understand me? And that's why I did everything in my power, Kiko, to try to get you to take the motherfucking folks alert, the folks alert down. Because, man, you was making yourself look like a straight ass. Do you think people is loving that shit? Yeah, people that don't like these niggas, people that are haters, people that don't like Ken, people that don't like Maroy, people that don't like Gov, of course they're going to get on there and comment and say negative things. But that ain't what it's about, man. If you put some shit on there, man, hey, man, uh, G. Gov just bought a new Bentley, or, you know, Pippin Ken just put another book out, or, you know, Maroy, you know, send me put a fabulous film out, then people will probably respect you more. You'll be able to get their fans. The name of the game is called Fan Jacking, my nigga. You got to jack niggas for their fans. You got to make people like you. Bishop said it best. You got to be loved in this game. You know what I'm saying? You can't be no motherfucking hater, and everybody, you understand what I'm saying, me, that speak about you, they speak nothing but ill of you. And that's what's happening, bro. You think people like you, but they really don't. You know what I'm saying? I hate to be the one to tell you because I, the reason why I never told you because I had to keep you close to me and I had to make sure that you never, you know what I'm saying, go on a tirade or you go off or you lose your motherfucking mind and get to posting the shit that you posting up again. I told you don't post that shit, Kiko. I told you that that shit don't put no money in your pocket. I told you that you putting your motherfucking life on the line. You understand know what I'm saying? Dude, you understand know me? I'm telling you, man, as somebody that's been around you for three years, dude, if you keep posting that shit, you know what I'm saying? Me, one of them hoes that you fuck with, or one of them girlfriends, or whatever the fuck you got, hey man, they gonna cross you, my nigga. And when they cross you, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? Me, you done did so much to so many people, man, guess what? This shit gonna go down, pimp. Karma gonna catch up with you, my nigga. You can't keep doing this shit. You know what I'm saying? Me, I tried to tell you that. I got you out that shit. I put some shit in your head. I told you, you know what I'm saying? Me, about your situation. You know what I'm saying? Me, you know. What your motherfucking status is. I told you. I said, man, all it takes is one motherfucking case, nigga. And your motherfucking ass gonna be deported. You won't listen, motherfucker. You understand what I'm saying? You wanna try to be disrespectful and disrespect all these niggas, man. And that shit ain't cool, dog. You know what I mean? You only fuck with niggas that fuck with you. Why are you fuck with all these niggas? Why are you fucking with Silky Slim? Why are you fuck with all these dudes, man, that ain't done nothing to you, man? You don't even know these people. That's what's so sick about this shit, my nigga. You don't even know these niggas. You don't know g -Gub. And then I tell you, my nigga, I said, listen, man. I said, man, take that shit down, a G Gov. I said, man, my people fuck with G Gov. I told you that. You claim to be a motherfucking friend. You claim to be cool with me. You tell me I ain't taking nothing down. I got to create my own legacy. Come on, my nigga. That ain't no legacy being a motherfucking hater, nigga. That ain't no motherfucking le legacy. You know what I'm saying? Me disrespecting motherfuckers, man. Don't you know that man got kids, man? Don't you know you have kids, man? You got to be a man, man. You got to quit acting like a child, my dude. You act like a little baby. You act like a little kid. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm mad. Oh, they didn't like me. Oh, they didn't let me play with their ball. Oh, because they didn't let me play with their ball. Oh, I'm finna put something negative up. Dude, that is fuckery, my nigga. That's bullshit. That's straight fucking bullshit, Kiko. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Take that folks alert shit down, nigga. You understand what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Get you some better shit to do, my nigga. Because I'm telling you personally. You know what I'm saying, man? Hey, man, listen, man. Shit is moving in on you, man. These niggas is not playing, man. These niggas is not playing. These niggas is not playing, dog. And they know where the fuck you at, man. You know what I'm saying? Trust me. You know what I'm saying? I know. And I'm telling you, man, you know what I'm saying? The best thing to do, you know what I'm saying, is to cut the shit short now. I know he's in Chicago thinking that I don't fuck with God, that I'm crossing God. 
That's crazy, but you supposed to fuck with me, Kiko? I told you don't put that motherfucking shit up, man. You put it up any motherfucking way, and then you gonna put some shit up on Pimp Some Hoes Down. You gotta send me talking about I didn't get motherfucking paid. Put a crack on that motherfucker talking about I ain't get no, get, get no motherfucking money. Nigga, anybody that know Pimp and Ken know you's a motherfucking liar, man. You know, motherfucking well, nigga, I love money. Niggas, every day they see me, I'm hustling, man. I got motherfucking books and DVDs every motherfucking way I go. Niggas know Pimp and Ken's a motherfucking hustler. So the fact that you would even think to put a crack on there to say that I ain't getting no motherfucking money, let me know, dude, that you're trying to make a move on me. You understand what I'm saying? Let me know, dude, that you really don't like me, dude. You understand me? And guess what, man? You understand me? The only reason why I really fucked with you was to try to keep you smooth, motherfucker, and keep you from losing your motherfucking life. I was trying to keep you from getting caught up with one of these niggas, man, and tell you, man, listen, man, take that shit down because shit is getting heated. And you listen. That's the crazy thing. You listen. You wised up, pimp, and then you fucked around, and you understand what I'm saying? I'm going to call you pimp. You wised up, sir, and then after, you understand me, you wised up, and you got away from me, you went and did the same thing. And sir, bar, in mouthpiece, listen, man, the man is more than likely is going to be probably coming at me. He's going to probably put me on, on his little website. He's going to probably be, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 playing some of the conversations that I said. Because, you know what I'm saying, you know, a lot of times when you're playing, you got a lot of game. You know what I'm saying, you got to agree with a motherfucker, make a nigga think that you agree with him. So, you understand me, you can keep him at bay. You know what I'm saying, me? a lot of shit that, you know what I'm saying, me, that, you know, I was saying to this nigga, a lot of shit that, you know what I'm saying, I was agreeing with this nigga, it was only to keep the nigga from putting that bullshit back on the internet. You see what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? He know that. You know what I'm saying? Me, nigga know me. He know I'm a master chess player. You know what I'm saying? He know that, you understand me, if you want to fuck with me, that's on him. You know what I'm saying? If you want to go toe-to-toe, brother, you understand me, you want some publicity, then, you know, you're getting it. But the publicity I'm going to give you, you ain't going to be able to stand it. I promise you. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? If I was you, I'd be wise and back the fuck up. You know what I mean? Because I go harder than everybody. You know what I'm saying? I go hard. When I'm on your ass, nigga, I'm on your ass for real. You know what I'm saying? We talking world star. We talking everything. And I ain't going to mention your site. I ain't going to blow you up, boss. You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? You know, if you're wise, you know what I'm saying? You take that bullshit down. You know what I'm saying? You quit bashing motherfucking niggas. You know what I'm saying? You quit disrespecting men. You know what I'm saying? You quit, you know what I'm saying? Putting that shit on the internet about kids, about, 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 about mothers, sons, and so on and so forth. Because you and I both know we didn't talked about this shit a lot of times. A lot of these dudes, man, they don't even know why they in jail. A lot don't even know what the fuck human trafficking is, man. You know what I'm saying? Man? And then you sit up there, you laughing at these dudes, and you making mockery of people, and you talking about you a street nigga, and you been to prison? Nigga, if you been to prison, you a street nigga, then you don't want to see no motherfucker go to prison. You know what I'm saying? Man? Dog, you was going to put niggas, you was going to put shit up, dog, of motherfuckers' hotels and all kind of shit back in the day, man. And, and I told you, when you sent that shit to me in my motherfucking uh, text box, I said, man, this is dry snitching, dude. Don't do that. He said, oh, okay, Ken, you're right, you're right. You know what I'm saying? I tried for years, dude, to give you some motherfucking common sense, man, and make sure that you don't do some dumb shit and you get caught up. But you won't listen. You always go back to doing the same old shit, man. It's not working, Kiko. People don't give a fuck about people going to jail. People don't give a fuck about, you know, who told this and who told that. You know what I'm saying? Yes, niggas want to know, you know what I'm saying, me? If, you know what I'm saying, one of their partners is snitching, niggas want to know if motherfuckers out here is working with the police, you know what I'm saying, me? but that ain't your job, because everybody in the world think that you're the police, my nigga, they ain't looking at you like you helping the game, I told you that, from the get-go, from the get-go, everybody think you're the police, don't no nigga think you uh, helping the game, you know what I'm saying, me? you think you're exposing soft niggas and snitches and all that, man, niggas ain't looking at that like that. Niggas looking at like, man, this nigga here, man, is destroying the game. This nigga is, is, is being disrespectful to the game. And that's fucked up. For you to say that you fuck with Pimp and Ken, and then at the same time, you know what I'm saying, I mean, you being disrespectful to the game, do you know how dumb you look, fam? Do you know how stupid you look? You know what I'm saying? You look like a fucking damn fool. Nigga, get your motherfucking self together. Get your act together. Nigga, quit playing. And niggas always say, well, Ken, what y'all to understand is this. Is that... When somebody like Kiko disrespects me and refuse to take down that shit on G-Gov and knowing that G-Gov is heavily connected in the streets and knowing that G-Gov people going to look at me like I'm with the shit, 
and knowing that my life can get in jeopardy because of this, I have to speak out. You know what I'm saying? You know, I mean, Kiko, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm just going to be real with you, man. You know, you, know, you, you know what I'm saying, me, has been like a cancer to me. You know what I'm saying, me? You know, you've been the worst thing that I ever, you know what I'm saying, I've encountered because you, all you do is hate on people. All you do is disrespect people. Then people get mad at me. And then when I tell you don't do it, you go do it anyway. That's like having cancer. You know what I mean? Like, damn. You know what I'm saying? Me, man, I need to get chemo. You know what I'm saying? This nigga is like cancer. And today I'm having chemo. You know what I'm saying? Me, I'm getting rid of the cancer. I'm getting rid of you, fam. You on your own. You know what I'm saying? Niggas would never associate me with you for. Ever, nigga, you can put whatever you want up on me. You can call me a snitch. You can call me a bitch. You can call me a fake. You know what I'm saying? Me, you know what I'm saying? You can say I'm married. You can say all that shit, dog. I don't give a fuck. You understand what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck, dog. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck. You know what I mean? Say what you want to say. Because after the day, ain't nobody going to your site. Ain't nobody going to Folks Alert no more. I'm not going there. I'm going to block you on all my shit. You know what I'm saying? You can't call me. I don't want to talk to you. None of that shit, fam. Because, you know what I'm saying, you've been very disrespectful. Get down like that. But I'm not going to let anyone disrespect me and treat me any kind of way. And Kiko, you done that. You treated me in a very disrespectful, inhumane way. You know what I'm saying? And I've been telling you for years, take that bullshit down. Dude, that site is bullshit. You don't get no fucking hits on that shit. I could go to anybody who want to check this nigga site. Go to Alexa.com and it'll show you this man's ranking. You doing all this shit, man, for no motherfucking attention. Oh, I got ID. I got 17,000 followers. Man, 17,000 17, followers on ID is like a raindrop in a storm, homie. That ain't no motherfucking followers. Half of that shit is motherfuckers trying to, you know, uh, uh, post their advertisement on there. That shit ain't real. Motherfucker trying to, for you to put that shit out on g to try to get me fucked off in the game. And then for you to follow up with a HBO motherfucker that I never heard of saying that Pip and Ken didn't get paid. Dude, what kind of motherfucker is you, man? How much do you hate your motherfucking self? Because you can't hate me. I ain't never did nothing but try to keep your motherfucking ass out of trouble and keep you alive, motherfucker. That's all I ever tried to do for you, man. You understand me? I tried to keep you from being deported, nigga. You understand me? I told you, nigga. You understand me? Yeah, you go out there, you blow a motherfucking brains out, and motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? They know you got beef with the motherfucker, and you on the internet. They gonna come get your motherfucking ass. I told you that, nigga. Remember that? You know what I'm saying? I said, do you want to be deported, nigga, and you don't see your motherfucking kids? And you said, Ken, you right. You forget the conversations real quick, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? But I can't fuck with you no more, dude, because you understand know me? You ain't right. You know what I'm saying? And you need to take that bullshit ass site down, dude. That site gonna fuck you off in the game, man. That site is gonna fuck you off in the game, dude. I'm telling you, man. Niggas, man, niggas been asking about you, dog, for four years. Four years. And niggas ain't never had nothing good to say about you, fam. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you never hear the shit because you ain't never in the streets. Can't nobody find you. And I and I always tell you, man, you know, man, you know, just chill out. You know what I'm saying? I mean, chill out, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, and G Gun and all them niggas know, man. You know what I'm saying? The real niggas know. They know what I was trying to do. They know that I was fucking with you because dude, you ain't on my level. We don't, you know what I mean? You don't have the game that I have. You know, we don't. We're not from the same cloth, you know what I'm saying? So the reason why I was fucking with you is trying to keep you alive, nigga. Trying to keep you out of the bullshit and trying to keep you from getting killed. From putting this bullshit on your site all the time. You know what I'm saying? Try to tell you, man, you know, do something positive, nigga. I even gave you some action and some money. You know what I mean? Come on, man. You know, let's keep it real, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, put your site out. You know, go in the morning and, you know, do some pivot can bashing or whatever, my nigga. But I'm about maybe 40, 50 million strongs and fans. You know what I'm saying? Be motherfuckers, you understand? Be know me all over the world. So, you know what I mean? You got a long motherfucking road to go to fuck with me. Now, you know what I'm saying? I, mean, I don't want to get into no back and forth with no nigga. You understand know me? You know, trying to disrespect the nigga, whatever. But I will. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know what I mean? If you, if, if you say something disrespectful for me, towards me, you know what I'm saying? I mean, 
I might not say nothing disrespectful back, but you understand me? I will address it. I will address anything that you say disrespectful. But it won't be the publicity that you want. I promise you that. And like I told you, man, when you put something on a nigga, you know what I'm saying, me, and, and, and uh, you know, you expose him, and maybe the police don't know it, that's dry snitching. A lot of the shit you do on Folks Alert is called dry snitching. You're snitching, but you're not wearing a badge. Everybody says, Kiko, the police. I said, no, he don't carry no uh, badge. But you know what I'm saying? He do a lot of police shit. You know what I'm saying? A lot of shit you do is police shit, dog. You know, go and get niggas records and all that shit and go and investigate motherfuckers, dog. That's police shit, my nigga. There ain't nothing smooth about that. Any street nigga and my motherfucking nigga, you understand? Know I fucks with you, mouthpiece. Mouthpiece. Man, the nigga recording your conversation. I heard the nigga record one of my conversations before he let me hear the. He accidentally, I heard the recording. He record everything you say. As soon as you don't fuck with him, he's going to try to come at you. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that's the type of nigga this nigga is. You know what I'm saying? The only reason why he never came at me is because I was smoother than him. I was far more intelligent than him, and he didn't know how intelligent I was. He didn't know that I was intelligent enough, enough to get him to take his whole fucking sight down. You know what I mean? You know a nigga got to be smooth. He get a nigga to take his whole sight down. You know what I mean? And to just disregard everything that he was doing and get on some other shit. I had to do what I did it for the game. So all y'all think that I was fucking with Kiko because, you know, I, I you know, this is my friend. I didn't even know the man. I didn't even know the man until uh, 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 my, my little homie from Minnesota introduced me to him. And then, you know what I'm saying, I got caught up in some bullshit. You know what I'm saying, me and one of my other homies that got into a, dis a discrepancy. And then, you know what I'm saying, he injected himself into the discrepancy. And then when I seen that the shit was going bad, I said, man, listen, man, woo, 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 woo. I had to go to work on the thing and I told nigga, take that shit down. And he took it down, and we didn't hear from Kiko for years. Nobody give me credit for getting a nigga to take the website down. You know what I'm saying, me? Nobody give me credit. I got him off the bullshit. You know what I mean? I got him. He was managing football players. He was doing big shit. That shit must have didn't go too well for him. And he got the itch, and he started back on the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, this is a real-life story. And people say, well, man, if, if, if Folks Alert didn't work the first time with the bullshit that you're doing, what the hell you think is going to work this time for? If you had to take it down because somebody had to give you and wise you up and tell you that what you was doing was self-destruction, then what you think, you know what I'm saying, is going to happen if you start that same self-destruction? Wise up, man. You know, be intelligent. You can say whatever you want to say about me. You can say whatever you say want to say about G Gov. You can say whatever you want to say about Maroy. But it ain't gonna change nothing. Cause guess what? People don't give a fuck. People don't give a fuck about me. They don't give a fuck about Gov. They don't give a, about, a fuck about Maroy when it comes to our business. If they love us, they love us for us. And they're gonna fuck with us regardless. I'm out. Peace. You know what I'm saying? Uh, G Gov. You know what I'm saying? Stay down. You know what I'm saying? Maroy, you know what I'm saying? I, mean, I know you upset with me, but I love you too, brother. You know what I'm saying? I Me mean, and all the other brothers out there, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, man, I love all y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? I Me mean, and Kiko, man. You know what I'm saying? Only thing I can tell you, man. Hey, man, you know. Hey, man, keep your head up, man. Hey, man, and make sure. A too real for TV exclusive. 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 Too real for TV.com.